Rovers had some blood. Harvest was poor, and women complained. Our neighboring village has seized our land in Ugodo. No! No, not in my time! My ancestors, you have I gone wrong! I can't take this anymore! Open again! I need the priestess! I need a manager right now! Wait! I need her right away, or else I'll feed her head to the vultures! Yes, come on. I shan't! Fever stone bread! <gasps> Wait, mother! This is serious! You have to do something about this now! You know that surrogate it is dance of the spirit. When a butterfly flies, he calls himself a bed. And when, at the end of a sacrifice, a vulture does not rubber, then, only then, there is a problem in the land of the spirit. Hmm? Oh, Malicha! For the past one hour now, you have been speaking in languages I don't understand. Speak now in the languages I understand because I am losing my patience. The cup is broken. The tears of a virgin maid cannot stop. Because the man who does virgin her has reason to take shelter of her. The pillars have fallen because incense has eaten deep into them. Omalicha! Speak now! Speak or else I will feed your head to the vultures of Abataga! Queen Mother! The ghost has left your rod of authority. Your time is over! It is time for another to ascend the throne! But Omalicha! What do we do now? My son has not a wife! All the maidens of the land will assemble. The praise is to pick a wife. And she must be crowned immediately. Else, more plague you will before the land. I have spoken. Makala kiri kiri, kana wukose, anada riyegu. This way. <laughs> oh, Baba. <laughs> Baba. <laughs> I have no friend. I have no one to relate me. Why? <laughs> Oh, 
Why, Mama? Look at Abster Free. <laughs> Look at Abster Free. Look at. We are the soup. My father's land. People of Awaza land, the Queen Mother summons the prayers of all the maidens at the village square at the third on quad day after the new moon festival the prince wants to make a choice of wife ghost of our land i thank you because my morning has come and my beauty will bring good fortune to me and my household adugo what are you trying to say you think the prince will select you? And why won't he? Which maiden in this our kingdom or a neighboring village can compete with my beauty? <laughs> Do you say beauty? What about me? My beauty cannot be compared. <laughs> Why are you laughing? And you, also like you, you are laughing too. Oledo. How dare you meddle in our conversation? Have you forgotten who you are and also? And by the way, what are you doing here? You should be in the farm by now. Go, go to that farm before we get there. Make sure you harvest those cassavas. If not, you'll see what I will do to you. Before we get there, make sure that all those cassava must have been harvested into this basket. Else, you will see how today. <laughs> that to be matter. Why are you laughing? Listen, Gochi, you cannot compete with my beauty. are going to banish all lady from this community. Ah, what happened? In the course of our land, I'll be missing. Okay, I pity that girl. That girl has really suffered. Yeah, really. Yeah. Even her step sisters. Oh God. They were saying that I go to stream. Fetch why I would do this one. Only the, the poor girl. I don't know why they call, the, the community hates this girl. Is it because she's an Otu also? Yeah. Let's go. Before our mother will be looking for us. Let's go. Yeah. Send for me. Yes, Arinze. But mother, I told you time without number not to address me as Arinze. I am Prince Arinze, address me as such. Never! Not in this land where women rule. Besides, I am your mother, the Queen Mother. I I'm the ultimate Asata one of this kingdom. I can never bow to any man. Never. But mother, when will this contention end between us? Not 
until you accept the fact that men can never rule this kingdom. Never. Is that the reason why you sent for me? I want to know how you're preparing for the selection of the next queen mother of this land. I'm sorry to disappoint you, mom. I am not ready yet. So, don't be silly. Are you happy with the way things are going on in this land? Choose a wife and put an end to this plague. I want you to choose a wife who can uphold the new customs and traditions of this land. A wife who can trample on the weak men of this land. A wife who can make men respect women. I need that from you, son. I've heard you, mother. <laughs> this boy knows nothing. <laughs> mother, I think you should give him some time. Time? Time? Time waits for no man. <laughs> This bead they are so beautiful, I like it too. Yes, I don't know. Oh, yes. This one will put you. Okay. This one, this one. Why don't you try? I do go! Yes, yes Magda. We know that thing. I okay. do go! No, no, no. Oh, give me that thing. They move us again now. What is going on, eh? Mama. What happened? Mama. You are selecting your beads. Yes, so Mama. Wow, it looks very good on you. Thank I love you. this one. Mama. Eh? I'm preparing for the bead day. Oh. This one looks very good on you. Thank you, Mama. Don't, don't worry, the prince will select you, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know. Oh, Mali Chan. You only pray for Adugo. What about me? Am I not good to be the queen mother? But she's the elder sister and it's her right. Is it by age? It's a matter of prank choice. Hmm. Hmm. Even at that, I Adugo is the most beautiful yes, lady uh, in this kingdom. And no one can compete with that. Yes, uh, hey. mother. You look very pretty. Thank you, oh. mama. Come back here, Ugochi. Where are you going to? Please come and fetch it up for me. I want to prepare food for my dad to eat. Oh. There, that's your most beautiful daughter. As for me, Ugochi, I am not fetching any water. Hey, this girl will not kill me in this house, eh? Who will not fetch it up for me? I want to prepare food for you to eat, Adam. Where is that you? That's Osuke. Where is she? You're right. Ha! Mm. Oh, no, Where is that girl? Maybe she's I've at the back. I've not seen her in Maybe she's at the back. Oh, no, Hey, I will deal with this girl. This well, I beg, man, eh? let me concentrate on my bead, I beg. Yeah, I can't wait to I want to be the queen mother of this land, and I must be the queen mother. Mm. 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 Eh? Mm. I am sick. Hey. Hey, she's sick. I am strong, you are sick. Yes, ma'am. You've been jumping up and down since morning. Now you are sick. Now, will you get off on that place? I go and fetch it. I want to make food for my daughter. Go and pick the pot and fetch that for me. I want to cook food for my daughter. Now. Are you sick there? Hey. What's up, man? I'm not feeling fine. You're not feeling fine? Yes, ma'am. You're not feeling fine. <laughs> will you tell that? Get off from that place now! <laughs> Come back here! Oh, so useless girl. Will you pick this thing up now? Pick it. Pick it up, useless girl. Pick it up. Go fast, go fast, stuff for me. These children, you are still playing by this time. Stand up, please. Return this chair to Mama and Kitchen. Tell her thank you, no mela. And make sure you come back on time, oh. Hola. Ah, my good my friend. friend. <laughs> okay. I'm fine, no. Oh. Ha. See the way you're shining. You're shining too. Adding my more meat. Right here. Hmm. You're looking beautiful, you too, my friend. Thank God. How are you preparing now? The prince will be choosing his lady. Yes, mm -hmm. I pray the prince will choose my daughter. You know ah. she's beautiful. Likewise, my daughter too. My beautiful dancer. Mm. <laughs> uh, hey, my dear friend. You know the wrapper and the bead I gave you the last time? Yes, yes, yes. I think I will need them now because I want my daughter, my beautiful dancer, to use those, those items. 
Okay. Ada! Please go inside. Go and bring that wrap and the bead. Okay. Your daughter is growing so big. Yes, my friend. Mm. Yes. You are really looking beautiful. You too. I like this other part. Ah, yeah. thank you. But don't come here. <laughs> my friend. Hola. Hola. My friend. What is this? The wrapper that you gave to me and the bead. Hmm. The wrapper? Yes. And the bead? Yes. Hola. Hola. When I was giving you this wrapper, it was looking so new because I've not used them. And this bead, I gave you two good beads. Looking so new because I've not used them. And I gave it to you because you're my very good friend. So what is this? My friend, that was exactly the wrapper and the bead you gave to me. Shut up! Get me my go take this. Go take this one. Get me my wrap. Hey, 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 hey! Come here, come here. Come here. No, 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 stop no, 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 with me. That was my last wrap. Come get me my wrap. This is the wrap you gave to my name. Shut up, fight! Slap you. This is the wrap. Eh, my prince. I want to ask you a very important question. Of all the maidens in this land, which of them do you have in mind? to be your wife and the next queen mother. Pekinga, my good friend, the whole thing is happening so fast. I don't want to get married now. Besides, there is something else bothering me. What bothers you, my prince? You can confide in me. I visited our neighboring villages. And I discovered that men rule that village. Men are king of their village. But here in our land, it is the opposite. My prince, do you know that I asked my father this same question? And he shunned me. Instead, he said, to think about it is a taboo in this land. You see? Ikenga, I need answers to this question, else I won't choose a wife. Greetings, my prince. Is that maiden all right? Young woman. My prince, what are you trying to do? Is there any pro problem? That maiden, my prince, Isanusu. And you are forbidden from having any form of conversation with her. Besides, my prince, it is getting late. Can we leave this environment? Let's go. My prince. Can we go? My prince! Let's... Look at them! I overheard you discussing about this forthcoming ceremony. Yes, of course. I am the next queen mother in this kingdom because I have everything that it takes for the prince, the prince to take me as a wife. <laughs> <laughs> See who is talking. Aleka, please choose you in this village when I'm here. Check me now. The prince cannot choose you. Are you override Popo? Why are you laughing? See this one. You're calling her override Popo. Chakol like you. Well, you know she's override Popo. She's even better than you. Tell her. Huh. Never. Prince choose three of you. Never. And the prince will not marry even you. Simweke. <laughs> Atangela, 
찬젤레 아 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 찬젤레 Great o m a n i t a I greet you. Hmm. Woman, I bring you to the shrine of Amalita. Great o m a l i t a the prince wants to choose a wife, and I want my daughter to be the next queen mother of this land. Hmm. A woman that asks the sun to rise from the west should know that the sun can only rise from the east. What you ask of me is impossible. Please, Great o m a r i c h a I want to be the next queen of our Zealand. Please, Great o m a r i c h a The Great o m a r i c h a I know that you have what it takes yes. to make my daughter the next queen mother of this great land. Please. Woman, leave my shrine before I strike. Please. I want my daughter. I want my daughter. To be the next queen mother, I know you can do it. Please, please. Leave before our manager strikes you. Leave. No. Ah, Tanjale, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, Tanjale. 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 Useless man. For how many years will you continue drinking? For how many years? I am leaving you for the prince. If you don't know, I am leaving for the prince. What do you think you are even going to? So, to marry the prince, can't you hear me? To marry the prince. <laughs> and what makes you think the prince will pick you as your wife? Look at this man. Look at me. Beautiful maiden like me. Look at me. Look at my breast. Why won't he take me? No, sir. This falling breast of yours. <laughs> he will definitely pick me, my brother. He will pick me today. I don't have time with you. No, sir. No, sir. In fact, why do you think you are going to? Anyways, you can go, sir. Let me go back to my house. If you like, come back. And if you like, you don't. I want my daughter to be the next queen mother of our kingdom. Woman, that is not my decision to make. Omaricha, I, I know, but you are the mouthpiece of the gods, and what you tell them will stand. Woman, what you ask of me is an abomination in the land. It cannot be done. Leave my shrine before I command thunder. Omaricha. You have the commands of the gods, and what you tell them is what they will do. I will bring clothes, jewelries, name it. Hmm. Woman, the gift of a man that say, make it the way for him. If I could, if I could be consider it done. Your daughter will ascend the throne of Awaza kingdom. Don't worry, Omaricha. I will bring half of the demands tomorrow. After the coronation, I will complete the rest. Hmm. Be careful, woman. Do not play with fire. Because fire burns and it burns fiercely. Jimmy Lee. When the frog rolls on the daylight, it is after something or something is after it. Oh, Tanjale. 
Understand. Oh, little. Me. With time. Mm. Only with time. You will come to understand. Mm. Only with time. Mm. You have been chosen by the great Amaro mm. to bring justice. Truth, faith, and strength to the men of our kingdom. Hmm. But Nne, I still don't understand. I thought this women authority thing is a cause of nature. I mean, is this not how it has been from the beginning? My daughter. Yes, Nne. Time. Time, I repeat, 
we answer hmm. all your questions. Sign. Hmm. Sign. Sign. Hmm. Okay, Nne. I've heard you. But I brought food for you. Eh? Thank you, my daughter. Yes, Nne. Eh? Oh, yeah, put down your stick. Eh, Nne. Mm. DK, I sent a message across to the people of Nduru to the seeds from my land at Igodo. What is the outcome? Nkume is yet to return. What is even keeping that in Kume? She's supposed to be back by now. Queen Mother, why not send another girl to go and look for her? Oh. Here she comes. Queen Mother. Rise! Ibanduka, strip me naked. A maze gas raped me. He said that women doesn't talk his palace. Shut up! You are a coward! They made a mess of you! And how many of them went stop by your sword? No, Queen Mother. Nine! Nine! No! Oh. We made up our other land! I'm not cowards! Fear is the greatest abomination in my time! Go! How can I marry a wife? And the wife, in turn, lots over me. How does it sound? <laughs> My prince, there is nothing you can do about it. That is just the way it has been. No. We can still do something about it. Someone, somewhere, should be able to tell us something about this. Because they say there is nothing hidden under the sun. I agree with you, my prince. Nothing is hidden under the sun, like you said. But even if we find out the history of this tradition, we still might not be able to do anything about it. <laughs> Why do you think so? My prince, for the start, all the men in this community are comfortable with this custom. Your que my queen, your mother, is a great fanatic of this tradition. And Omanicha the priestess, she can go to any extent. I mean, she can even go to the point of killing any man who goes contrary to this particular custom. Can you hear any sound? I think I can hear the voice of someone crying. Exactly what I want to see. Someone is crying. And do you know where that sound is coming from? Could it be that way or this way? I think it's this way. way. I think it's this way. Let's go and check. Yeah. Let's go and check. I give you. Dear, 
Mario! <laughs> That's so bad! <laughs> exactly, by this time of the day, he's still <laughs> <I'm not> <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful maiden, what troubles you? And why are you here all by yourself? Greetings, my prince. Why are you crying? You again? <laughs> no, my prince. <laughs> She's forbidden from being touched by the royals. Enough, Ikenga! <laughs> what is this about this? Don't you see this lady look pitiable? Please! Why are you crying? I'm sorry, my pain. You have to take me. <laughs> Wait! Wait! Listen to me. Even if all the people in this village reject you, I, the prince of this land, I will not reject you. Please, your tears troubles me. Why these tears of yours and stop crying? Please. Please. Stop crying. Take it easy. Cry. Stop crying. Where are you going all dressed like this? I am going to the palace. The prince invited me. Hmm. The prince? Yes. Are you sure? You. Same for you. For what now? <laughs> I don't understand. What do you have? I can hey. see that you guests are jealous. Je jealous? It's like you guests have no head. Hmm. I, Adugo, is going to be the next queen, queen mother of this kingdom. <laughs> queen mother. Hmm. Queen mother. Ah, I'm leave her alone. Hmm. Our upcoming queen. Upcoming queen. Oh, Malicha. <laughs> you think he's. Leave her. Ah, you think he's. Oledo, get some water. Hmm. Oledo, I'm hungry. Hmm. Oledo, wash my clothes. Hmm. You know that one. Tell her. How about your head? That they will dance. Oh. You shake your waist. Show her. Do you have this? <laughs> it's, your, it's your tiny waist. Hmm. Listen to me, you girls. And I know you guys are know what I'm capable of doing. I, Adugo, is going to be the next queen mother of this kingdom. And if any of you stand on my way, I will kill you. Hey! See, see how you see this girl? Stupid girl, girl. useless thing. Hey, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Let's, let's go, go. Let's leave her alone. alone. Ha. Stupid girl. What are you doing here? I am looking for the prince. He invited you to the palace. Wait. Follow me. Your Majesty, may your reign bring good tidings to the people of Owaza land. Rise. You said my son sent for you. Yes, Your Majesty. The prince invited me to the palace. What is your name and who are you? I'm Adugo, the daughter of Maze Hamifula. The name of your father is not important. Who is your mother? My mother is Nego. The daughter of Maze Obasi, the great hunter of Awaza King. What have your mother contributed in the history book of Awaza land? 
Or is she a nobody? Welcome, Adugo. You can have your seat. Thank you, Your Majesty. Oche Dike, fetch me Arinze. Yes, Your Majesty. Queen Mother, his heart is desolate. Oh, that's poor. Beautiful maiden. Yes, Your Majesty. My son is not in at the moment, so you have to wait for him. Yes, Your Majesty. Oche Dike. Queen Mother. Make our visitor comfortable. Okay, Mother. Did he promise to marry you? I'm yet to know his intentions. Mother, I was told you looked for me earlier. Yes, your visitor is looking for you. Mother, did I tell you she is my visitor? Young lady, are you deaf? Is this not Arinze you seek for? Prince Arinze. Arinze! And who? Are you, young woman? My, my prince, you, you invited me to the palace. When? How? Have I met you before? Mother, if this is the way you want to tie me down to this marriage, then forget it. Because this will not work. I am not moved by this. You! Is it not my son you're looking for? You lied to me? You made me look common before my son? Oh, Dike! Mother! Make this thing vomit all she has swallowed! Your Majesty! Please, I'm a woman who is just in love. Please, for me, give me... Kinga, don't you think it is high time you drop this your tradition you hold and never to leave? Osu or no Osu, we are all equal. Besides, Ikinga, do you love me? My prince, of course you know I love you. After all, you are my only friend. Then if you love me, you must love those I love and accept those I have accepted. You must accept Oledo and love her. Okay, my prince, I've had you. To prove to me that you have accepted, why not hug her? That reminds me, Ikenga, something happened at the palace yesterday. What happened? A maiden was at the palace yesterday. She said I invited her over. You need to see the way she was dressed. She was dressed in a showy manner just to seduce me. But I think my mother, the queen, planned it. I don't think she did that. She's my sister. And she's desperate of becoming the next queen mother. Did you say she's... I think she planned it with my mother. Did you just say she's your sister? Yes. Her name is Adugo. No wonder. You need to see the way she was 
displaying at the palace. <laughs> 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 hey, there are some funny people. Here. Very funny. Ah, so far, lad. Hey, my prince. Tomorrow is the D day, and you are going to be making a choice. It is giving me great concern. I need answers to my many questions. My prince, questions like what? Only do. Yes, my prince. I cannot choose a wife that will rule over me. I feel it is not normal. It is not like that in other land. Is our land different? You are right, my prince. But this is our custom, and you cannot change it. I know of an old woman that lives in the forest of Awaka. I think she can help my prince. Prince Arinze of Awazalot. So long I've waited for this day. It's she, it's she, huh? How come she knows my name? No, my prince. But sometimes she speaks mysteries. But I know she has answers to your questions. What ye seek? I have lived 300 years waiting for. I thank the gods for keeping me alive to this moment. Women had no place in the throne of ours a kingdom. Not until one day a great plague befell the kingdom. <coughs> Our goats Cattle, chicken, even humans died one after the other, day by day. Your grandfather, Igwe Onyebula Ume, sorted for solutions. All to no avail. He became even more confused until he lost his first son, Amaji. It was a bad thing to be sage. <coughs> But she could not bear this pain, so she took it upon herself to find the lasting solution to this great problem. She traveled far to a distant land in search of a witch doctor named Omalicha. Is it the same Omalicha we know today? No, she... Yes! The same Omalicha. What? She renews her life every year with three virgin heads. 
she gave your mother, she gave your grandmother, but she a condition the people of our land will worship her goddess Omame and men will never ascend the throne of our kingdom. <coughs> this means that your grandmother which she will be a queen mother and your grandfather must die. Though it was a difficult decision, but Omalisha gave her a concussion that will make her stronger, even more stronger than a man. <coughs> I picked up the crown and took it to the shrine of Ama Oro. Few weeks later, the crown disappeared. But later on, I discovered that the gods had taken it to a watcher. Why would the gods do such a thing? It is because the crown will be restored on you, Arinze, as a symbol of authority over your mother and the offer you shall use to defeat the great witch of Malicha and you will restore our land our land ours but why can't she help a dying village without her terrible conditions Malisha had won one goal and that is a life of immortality immortality our village will be a privilege to her as she sacrificed three heads of virgin each year how then do we get this crown, Nano for? It is a 12 days journey by foot. Tomorrow is the D-Day. And that I'm not present at the palace. The land will be destroyed. I know. But I have a solution. I have a solution. Are you ready for this? Yes, I am ready. <laughs> I am ready. Giddy, giddy, you go as a Ochiya Mata, Vidya Kayeni. I can for you, fool. Oh, what's your ya? Plague that has.
have befallen this land. On this day, my son, Arinze, shall choose a new bride, a new queen to ascend this throne. And on this day, our land shall be restored. Our water purified. And sickness shall cease from this land. And we shall be happy again. And now, let the music begin. Not in his heart, neither anywhere around here. He's not in his heart? Yes, grandmother. Not in his heart? Get me three guards right now. Okay, my queen. This boy. This boy. Mother, rise. Go around every hole, every hut in this kingdom. I need a reason right here and now. Yes, yes, yes mother. mother. Go.
me or Malita right now. Yes, Queen Mother. Don't leave, Queen Mother. I'm already here. No matter how long a man who stands, it must surely fall. The gods made their choice. Yay! And who can that be? If I could, if I could have you, I don't choose the one. Oh, oh, oh. 